Oh, and we are playing Metro Exodus. It's like seven in the morning. Well, it has been years since anyone's heard anything but static and white noise on the radio. Who could still believe we are not alone on this earth? My wife, my comrades from the Order, my friends, people from my station. Nobody believes me. They are sure that there's nothing on the radio. Sure that save for us, who hid in Moscow Metro, there were no survivors of the last war. We are alone on this planet, and in the metro it's common knowledge. But I did hear that call on the radio with my own ears. Yes, it was immediately drawn out by the static, but I had heard it. Which means that somewhere out there, under the skies, there's still a habitable place. We're not doomed to live the rest of our lives underground. Still. Nobody believes me. It's okay, Artyom. <coughs> you make them believe. What the fuck? And we just did this part. Somebody kidnapped us, right? Oh, that's where the video ended. Up. that metro passes <laughs> we get kidnapped man large at least they have one gun now that's what I call a This is where the video just started. You should have checked first, assholes. Artyom, thank God. These people, they're Hansa, not the Order. Assholes. They did a number on you. Well, Dad will rip them a new one for that. What's going on in this Moscow of yours, anyways? Of yours? You're putting this like you're not from here. We aren't. Our village is about 200 kilometers from here. What village? You're not from Moscow? Just a regular village. We came here to find the boy's father. Left for Moscow about a year ago and never came back. But then we got caught by these here. You mean there's life outside? Why wouldn't there be any? Sure, there are lots of bad places and lots of beasts around, but we still get by. Artyom, you're right. People really do live out there. We didn't know. We thought we were the only survivors. God, really? we'll tell the whole metro about this. What is this? You people drove us halfway to nowhere. They can handle it. At least give them the masks back.
Let's go. And up. Oh, that was so dead. I think they will open fire the sea in the moment. What if I do this? Attention! The turntable is switching off! Here. We won't accept this shit again, okay? 
Chief for interrogation. I can't take you to the main entrance. Too many guards. But we may sneak in from the back. Let's go. Don't rush them. If they notice you, we're both done for. Wait. You better not walk into the light. Let's do it this way. You sneak to the lighting panel and disable it while I distract them. air for the command center. It's not that large, actually. Wait for the moment and go through. I will, of course, do what I can, but uh, I, I'm not much of a fighter, as you could guess. Good luck to you. Oh, I'm 
Frustrated over and you are hearing the podcast. Oh and I need to build the stuff up here. Because the war is still going on, and you behave like fucking kids. All the guards will be here soon. Damn. Not with him. With you. You have to run. Is this yours? They just left it sitting there. We must get out before they recover. Guards. You have to go sneak through the courtyard. Take the door the guards are coming through. Here, quick. Let's go. Who are you? Andrei Ivanovich Yerbeck, the train engineer. Run now! Just get to the center, then God willing, I'll get you out of here. So I'll get there easily. Why are you helping us, Andrei Ivanovich? I had... Uh, uh, I guess I'll tell you later. I hope. Hey guys, Be careful. I see the enemy. Give me a boost. Can't really see well with the snowstorm. Don't forget your visibility gauge, Atyom. If you don't move too fast and don't come out into the light, you'll be harder for them to notice. Don't turn your flashlight on either, they could notice. Atyom, they're coming towards them. I'll give you some cover from above. Okay. Almost something. Oh, Nick, what's this one? I think I should kill them, but sneaking past them is not that easy.
see him. Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> So I moved silently, but I film. Don't turn your flashlight on either. They could notice. Artyom, incoming. Go on them. I'll give you some cover from above.
If I kill anybody, I will be noticed in a second. This is the only way I see the world. Glad to see you here. Are you all right? I'm fine, thank you. All right. We don't have much time. They'll be back. I'll go to the engine. It should be ready now. You go up there and Come switch the down. turntable mechanism on.
Legislation dictates they be killed. In any case, I have to get them out of town until it all blows over. But you all should stay. Hear me, Major? My people are in no way related to it's not my this call and you're misunderstanding. Not. Well, I'll fight for the guys no matter what. Of course, Artyom, Anna, they are the with us. There's no one behind. It's it's not not us. Us. Ooh. Ooh. All right, Spartans, throw these overboard and full steam ahead. Come with me, Artyom. Let's catch them there. 
I'm so glad the boys supported us. It looks like my father didn't say a word to them about this either. We spent 20 years in Metro, thinking the rest of the world was burnt to a crisp in the war. But they just circled Moscow with those jammers, and we were none the wiser. How perfect of them! Perfect. That's the place. Lying. lying to you, to me, to everyone, the whole fucking world, and not even batting an eye. Okay. So there are monsters. Target's always! And my 
Find the engine! Don't hit the boiler! start from here thank you guys for watching stay tuned for more and don't forget to subscribe guys so stop